Track Wrestling with Eric Keller. We're at the 2020 Multi-Divisional National Duels. First of all, let's go way back. You miss this being at the Dome. I do miss this being at the Dome. That was a, an unbelievable event with every single division um, under one roof. The, the fans, just, just what it meant to student athletes, having everybody in there. I mean, there were 20,000 people in there. Um, so we, we miss that, but the NWCA does an outstanding job. This is a great event. I love this event. I mean, it's so much different than a tournament where you got guys spread out and wrestling individual matches. I mean, everybody's behind each other, everybody's supporting each other, everybody's right there together collectively. Uh, it's, it's, it's awesome. How do you come back from back-to-back -back falls? This is nuts how this plays out sometimes. You get back-to-back -back fall, or Augsburg does, and then you get a fall of your own. How do you process that as a coach because it's coming at you so fast? Short-term memory, you got to, you got to. I mean, being able to, to just, it's, it's, as soon as that match is over, shift gears, you know, because you got a guy getting ready to come out that he needs you. He needs your emotion, he needs your focus, and, and regardless of what just happened, you know, he needs you ready to go back on even keel. And so, uh, but you're right, that was, that was, that was crazy. I mean, back and forth, back and forth. Well, what was your thought process and some of your lineup shifts from yesterday to today? Um, I mean, a lot of it, trying to give guys opportunities. Uh, we, we gave a lot of different guys opportunities yesterday. Um, trying to figure out matchups. You know, I mean, with these duels, strategy and matchups have a lot to do with it. And uh, you know, just piece together the right group at the right time. Battle of the Bergs, though, when you come in, it's just what everyone expects to happen, and it just keeps going on and on and on. Why do you think this rivalry has really transcended the sport? I mean, it's been 20, what, 27 years, whatever whatever it's been, you know, I mean, I, I should know the number, but, you know, I mean, it, that many years of, of two teams battling it out, you know, and that's a great team. They wrestled, they wrestled really well, and, you know, we, we, we had to fight for everything, yeah, but that's what you want, you know, I mean, the, the bigger the battles, the, the bigger the fights, the more they mean to you. And uh, you know, I, I'm, I'm real happy with how these guys stepped up. You'll have a couple more times to see them. You'll have Battle of the Bergs at your place and then the NCAA Championships in Cedar Rapids. What kind of adjustments do you make as you go down the line? Quite a bit. You know, I mean, that was the thing. We got done with that and we got done meeting and I could tell guys were like trying to feel me out. And I found myself already wheels turning, you know, I mean, it's because it is. It's back to work, you know, it's January. And there's so many improvements that need to be made. Um, you, you saw a lot of things this weekend in, in the amount of duels that we wrestled. I uh, saw a lot of things in this last duel. So, I mean, it's, it's trying to get guys better every single day, you know, and just keeping the focus on that, not, not worrying about anybody else. Just keep getting better every day in the room and taking care of what you can take care of and, and keep having fun. How long will you enjoy this championship, though? You know, it feels good. It feels good, you know, I mean, Last year not being in the finals, um, and, and two years ago getting second. And we had won seven in a row before that, you know, so um, I missed it. I missed it. It feels good. It feels good. By the time I get back to Waverly, I'll be ready to get back to work. Eric Keller, thanks for the time. Of course. Thank you.